is one year I could live without you, but any more than that, I would be devastated. Right. I don't think I could go on further, and I think... Okay, now let's rock this bitch. Come on. Wait, there's a meeting as well. Hell yeah. Well, you fit the hey. Yeah, that's my girl's BFT just, meeting. Give me two Why seconds. Why don't you change, bro? Brittany, Brittany, because come I here. Don't move, ready to move, move. Like Wait, hold on. I want to talk in. Go the fuck over. Scoot over, you stupid fucking blonde bitches. Scoot the bitch. Scoot the fuck. Go. Fucking like fucking huge ass fucking party of fish. They're fucking, what's it called? Finding Nemo ass fish, just sardines, just fucking crowded as fuck. Fucking stupid fucking. Oh. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Hi, Zoe. What's going on? <laughs> Why'd she make. Big. Where are you running? Why were you. <laughs> she scared the fuck out of me. Well, I just woke up here at a clock in. I was going to have a meeting with Mia. Do you oh work God. here? I actually just got signed as a janitor. Oh, oh my gosh. Congratulations. Thank you. I appreciate it. Is she here? Is yeah, she... everyone's here. Oh, okay. I, I did get some, though. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> everyone is flooded. Hello? 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 <laughs> I oh, so good to see you too, Shannon. Oh, Shannon, baby, what's going on? You know, we're gonna have to unpack oh that my later. God. I'm here on business yeah. right now. Had an emotional day. Aww. That sucks. Um. Oh. Can. Oh. Hi. Hi. Full Hi, house girl. tonight. Hi. Hi. Yeah. Damn, everyone's fucking here. Um, we're here to show well, support. Well, I'll, I'll leave it up to you, Mia. Do, are you yeah. okay with having other girls sit here? Yeah. No, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. I invited most of them to here. Um. So I just want to get my outfit out the way. This is my cocoon, and I'm not I'm not ready to blossom, you know. I'm not ready to She's so cringe. myself yeah into my beautiful butterfly. I'm still finding myself. That is Anyways. okay. Yes, okay. love that for you. We are here for you. Yes. You. Um, okay, like I just wanted to talk about things because I do like uh -huh. blue chat. Let me not shout actually. I do like blue chat. Okay, like I do, like obviously, like I have a lot of friends here now. I have a lot more friends here, and like obviously, I had Noel and Nico. You know, everyone, everyone was here. Yeah. Um, this is the first record label that I signed to. The, it's the record label that I wanted to initially stay with. Mhm. Mm you know, I wanted to stay with this label, and I wanted to like be with you guys, but like some things happened, and I feel like during the course um. of the time that I was here, things got a little bumpy, a little too bumpy. Are you guys so taking I, down notes? I ended, I ended up quitting. And I, you take know, this down, I take this down. I never really spoke to you about it. I guess I never really mm -mm. technically, like, if I was to speak to someone, I would have come to you or, you know, um, Pimani, but I didn't really come to anyone. I just, I guess I was just so red with rage that I just kind of got up and left. Take this down, guys. Um, yeah. And, and okay, so I just want to, like, I would just like to talk about some issues that I had with you. Go into a little bit more in depth. depth uh huh. About them. Not yeah. with you. I mean, like, you know, Issues no, that I, I know. Had to come up with you. Um, mm -hmm. Okay, so first of all, I just felt like okay, so I was here for a long time. I was here for like six months, and I feel like with like management, I just feel like there was just like no support from Amen. anything. Like I remember, I had like song Amen, releases, Mia, speak your and truth. I feel like nobody ever. I know, like I could have put a bit more effort into to say like, hey, like I want to release a song. Could we do something for it? But times when i did i feel like you miss no noel about time same reciprocation at all literally like, just, i miss know, valentine so much fuck about my release kind of and you know like, as me really, i feel like that's kind of like it kind of hurt because considering at the time like before the receipts we weren't really getting paid um i feel like it was just like the least that we could do you know help support releases i feel like as well um when it was like promotions and you know we'd post something on twitter for our song releases like People wouldn't even give the time of day to even like retwat the tweet, you know. I feel like so promotions were like kind of iffy as fuck. Um, okay, which okay. Was a reason why I just like one of the reasons uh -huh. why I I'm jotting this down. Yep. Not. Um, another reason. Um, I feel like I was here for a, quite a while. I was here for six months, and I remember everybody around me was. Uh, I think I was here. I could have been here for a little bit longer. I don't remember, but I feel like everybody around me was going somewhere. Like there was getting promotions and like 
all of a sudden Harry was hired and like instantly promoted to like upper manager and you know I just felt like I was just like staying in the same position which at the end of the day is like fine but I feel like you know sometimes it's nice to be recognized a little especially by the label that you're working with so I thought that it would have been kind of nice to I don't know like got not necessarily promotion but even just some praise like hey Mia like you're doing a great job I feel like nobody ever even like said that you know oh um, Mia okay well that just for me um i'm gonna just say right or there. at that time of the you know, me and you have had Mia. a pretty long relationship since you've mm -hmm. been here and i've never been shy to tell you how much i'm proud of you for doing yeah, this yeah so so you're you were looking from that from specific people right is that kind of yeah. like yeah like i feel yeah. like i feel like it's you know i feel like more as like the company like obviously you're a big part of the company but i feel like you're uh -huh. more of like a friend that's like a friend telling me they're like they're proud of me you know and i feel like you know seeing yeah it, Seeing it come from some, someone else like would have been nice. People that I don't like necessarily, like mm -hmm. I'm not necessarily friends with in the company, you know, like so, it would have. Mm -hmm. One thing I will say is I remember um, the only time that I really remember you being at a big event was Wuchella. And mm -hmm. that was because I had organized it for the most yes. part. Yeah. So um, I, and, and here's the problem. I, I do understand what you were saying yesterday about Damien um, mm -hmm. specifically favoring people that he is close to when it comes to sets and everything like that. Yeah. But a big part of the other thing is that at that time, at the time that you were here, we weren't really doing a lot of pop-up stuff. So, and then there was like a million people signed to the label fighting for a slot. Like mm -hmm. every single day that we were like scheduling something, it was hard to get like everyone on there. And obviously yeah. like the whole ticket thing was a mess and, and that really prevented it. And another thing was just the fact that, like, I feel like everything that happens in terms of, of people getting to know you and the label and, like, give you your flowers happens when you stick around after the performance, like, hours after. Mm -hmm. you the know? way I'm, like, listening so, in on to this, and I, I don't, I'm, like, in-depth listening. I don't really necessarily remember you staying around that long <laughs> after you would do something. Like, I think you would probably, like, go to bed after because of, like time stuff yeah you know? yeah i haven't yeah, said a so word in so long true. i'm like yeah. focused so as fuck. i think really a lot of it is a miscommunication that's i'm not trying to invalidate what you're saying like i do no, yeah i definitely see those concerns but mm. i think probably a lot of what was happening with you feeling like you weren't getting the praise you received is because you weren't really around to receive it you know yeah yeah i get that but i just feel like there, there could have been like other than like after performance like other times where you know like like i feel like people were like I know there's certain requirements you have to meet to get like a bonus for example or something but i feel like that never like really came my way even though like i was like you know i was trying to be an active part of the record label um and also like i was seeing stuff about the damien and harry stuff yesterday i just feel if i get into that now like i just feel like oh. damien is sorry i don't mean to like jump to no, another no, subject no. so quickly you're fine we can get into it i actually got yeah. into it with both of them last night so oh my god I'm uh, sorry if I you guys heard like that. Just the way they like the, you weren't supposed Harry, to hear that. He's <gasps> like I feel like he's very nice. He's really good at what he does. I you know, have... he can be very nice. But Damien, on the other hand, um, I feel like he's very. Um, I I ate gumbo the other day. Very, he can be very rude sometimes. A lot of seafood like doesn't very, work um, with me. I think the word is like egotistic. Oh, Almost, like, that's power <laughs> hungry. Um, I'll give you one specific instance. I walked into the office one time and he was talking to Mr. K. Um, and instead of saying, oh, like, Mia, we're having a conversation, she might leaving, he was like, Mia, get the, or get the fuck out of here if you're not supposed to fucking be in here. And I feel what? like as someone, as someone who is, like, a manager, you know, I feel like a little, I have a little respect for the people that work for you, you know? Because this yeah. isn't, like, you know, it's, it's... it's oh, wow, the, Mia, the oh, wow. That we expect from our manager. Especially yeah. as someone who wants so much power to be, like, that rude, it's just kind of unnecessary. Uh, and I feel like that, for me, that one specific day, I'm clocked um, in, Daniel. Like, one of my like last straws. Daniel, I'm clocked from, in right now, there dude. Was instance that happened with Zoe, but like before the Zoe instance that happened, um, that was definitely something that got on my last nerve. Yeah, that was, is like, unacceptable. I, I wish mm. you would have came to me about that when it happened. I would have dealt with it. I mean, I'll yeah. still deal with it, but like you know, mm. um, what happened with Zoe? If you don't mind me asking, or oh, if Zoe um, wants to talk about it. Yeah, I'm. I'm sure. Zoe, are you okay with me? No the situation. You don't want to talk about it. No, no, imagine. Um, I can give a little TLDR mm. from my POV. I feel like you're always talking about your POV, which is like 100% true. But I feel like my POV as, oh, as well. Yeah, go ahead. Ooh. So, 
confused. I think there's a local cat running around the witch. Oh! Uh oh. Uh, you know, uh -oh. you're reminding me of Jasmine Masters when she's sat on her balls right now. Perfect. Like, it's just giving the same vibe with the bob and the, the <laughs> blue. <laughs> I love it. So, I love it though. Oh my god. Oh! Um, oh, so, so I walked into uh, Wu Ching Idol Auditions, I believe it is. Um, and you know me, that, that night I was feeling very quirky. You know, more than, oh, yes. like very different. So, you know, I went on stage, I did my thing, and then I left. And, you know, um, Mia and Brittany comforted me and tried getting me back to do do it again. So as we're walking back, um, I guess Mia heard this and Brittany heard this. I didn't quite hear this. I was kind of out of tune. I forgot about this. But honestly, yeah. they heard a whisper from inside, which who, who was there? Was it Harry and like a few other people? It wasn't Harry that said uh, it. I don't but... think it was Harry. Harry like wasn't talking at the time, but it was the people that Harry had brought in to judge the Wu Chang Idol audition. Yeah, and they're, they mm -hmm. whispered. A of people that I do, couldn't even give you their name. They like spoke softly, but enough for us to hear them say, oh, it's those girls. Right. And then, like, you know, it was just a little uncalled for. I would understand if I did some kind of actions to, you know, evoke that reaction but you know i just didn't and it was uncalled for it was unnecessary and as like someone that was auditioning i just felt invalidated disgusted but this wasn't about me this was more about mia because this is the people that mia was you know i guess in cahoots with or about to work for or still working for well, I mean, I was, go I ahead was and explain more I, yeah i was still working at the time for wu chang like i wasn't even like on the verge of leaving um, but as soon as like that was just like the the tick of a. Did you guys hear my cat? <laughs> Is that my dog? And Zoe walking into the room, and then they were like, "Oh, it's these girls," and that was the free people that Harry had chose um, to help him uh, be the judge panel for Witch guys, Idol. Guys, my fucking time. cat hissed at my dog. Was, like you know, you're saying that oh, about one of your time. employees, yeah. So they were like really bottom of the barrel. Yeah, whoever was I, left to judge, I, like I literally right. could not fucking tell you their names. Right. They didn't even know. Right. And like again, that's another point. Like, right. I think it would have been nice if you know people that worked for Wu Chang were asked, you know. But instead, it was just like that's what I meant about it being Harry's friends. You know, like it was whoever mm -hmm. Harry was closest to was being invited to do this stuff, and I felt like, you know, I don't mean to overstep, but it would have been you know nice if we we spoke about it as a group, maybe, or like you know, it was just something that. It, well, we discussed together potentially. I definitely guys, see my that. fingies um, hurt. Can I someone like kids making okay? No, let's joke. The, oh, those girls. I mean, girls. Honestly, if you want to be like half empty, half full, look at it optimistically. At least we're being recognized as the girlies, you know. True, but true, yeah. But you know, I do see girlies. that's like a negative thing. Like it's kind of like oh, those girls, those quirky yeah. girls, those quirky girls that are stinky, you know, like. Mm -hmm. Like that. It sounds like I'm like it, it sounds immature. Shannon stuff, looks like, awful. Why would we even care about that? But I don't know. It just like it's sometimes no, it, it's it happens valid. so often. It like it gets it gets annoying. And then when it comes from people that you literally are is supposedly work with, that's like yeah. oh okay. It's valid to be annoyed about because all of us girls are individuals, but oh. to the common <laughs> man, mm -hmm. they lump us all together. Exactly. You know. Yeah. So it's I understand why you guys were upset by it. I would be too. Mm -hmm. Um. I don't know who the fuck Harry invites. I'll be completely honest with all of you. I just recently started waking back up and getting involved with all this shit. Um, yeah. And I, even even with that, I haven't like done anything as far as planning any events or set lists or anything like that. I let Harry handle all that. But, um, you know, I think comparing the company, how it's being ran right now compared to how it was back in January, when, what you know, do you guys think, chat? With and what do you guys think? Because yeah. I feel like there's only um, one way to think. It's so. pretty obvious that Harry and Damien are kind of overstepping. Yeah. Um, and the th reason why they feel like they're comfortable to do that is because I wasn't here to step on either of their toes and tell them to knock it off. Mm -hmm. But that has obviously changed. Um, yesterday, we had a situation where um where what harry said he wanted to have a meeting with shannon oh in his ceo office okay. and harry told me that i wasn't allowed to be in the meeting oh that's not something you say to yeah. me that is not something you say to me i have been here i remember when harry got hired i could have made sure harry never got hired to this company oh okay right. same <gasps> with damien i've been around way longer than both of those bitches so oh <gasps> for them to tell me i can't sit on a meeting no matter how ridiculous it is 
that's Pasito. not okay. Right, so yeah. I had I confronted them and I was like, what like what are you saying? Girl. Like we are supposed to run this shit as equals. You know, you're not you, you're like not stepping on my toes. I'm not gonna step on yours. Or if you start to do that, I'm gonna step on you even harder, <laughs> bitch. Because when I get pee money involved, then it's okay. Then who's really yeah. gonna listen? Right. So I said it straight and I made it known that all three of us run this shit as equals, regardless of whoever has been around, whatever, you know? So yeah. I don't want any of them to step on my toes. And if I hear that they're doing any shit like telling you to get the fuck out all rude and anything like that, I will confront them and I'll let them know not to be behaving like that because they haven't, they have a job as an executive and as a manager. Mm -hmm. I made both of them executives actually. Yeah. My See, that's just, like, that's, I'm glad that you like experienced that again. as well. Like obviously like <laughs> not in that kind of type of way, but like I'm glad you experienced it because that's exactly like what I mean. Like I remember there was one day it was like everyone was together and they they're just like this whole clicky thing is oh we're quickly having a meeting like everyone's together as a group it's like oh meeting come over here oh you're not allowed to come it's like not it's it's not even like professional it's giving like high school like come over here but like can't come like it was it was Ooh, weird like, it's not, oh my god i was always part of that you know, was, yeah, oh my god wait that's odd. giving high school no me just give me a throwback i, I, I used to be like thing as with um patrick can you come talk to me Harry, Oh, is not that, you, um, not you. Like, that was me. Want, oh, like, he, God, I hate myself. He would never want right, to anyways. be the person that is making people feel like that, right? Like, he doesn't mm -hmm. ever intend to do it. Yeah. But I think Damien's delivery sometimes is just so blunt. No same. So, like, <laughs> not We're done. defined. We're that, done. That um, yeah. it gets interpreted so as very, what? very negative. And, Mods. and the thing is that I, I have a relationship with Damien that is so tumultuous because i agree with a lot of stuff that he says sometimes he does make some points but the way that he talks about it and brings it up is something that turns a lot of people off and it turns me yeah. off sometimes too i'm like chill you know um and then on the other side there's me and i'm usually very like i'm very the opposite you know me and damien are kind of like good cop bad cop mm -hmm. i people tell me to do something i'm like yes of course bestie slay um and it's it's kind of like something that we have like this dynamic that we get just, that we, emote we out of my balance. chat now but, um at the end of the day i'm gonna be very honest with you girls no matter if me and damien disagree on something if i say it it ends up happening it's happened yeah. so many times mm -hmm. so many times because honestly when I ask them Get for their opinion that emote. i'm not asking them for permission i'm asking them for their opinion i'm gonna do it anyways right so get that Emote. It's, it's like stop it i i'm sorry that they they treated stop me it. like that and i wish i would have known that it was happening stop um, it. i was you know you know in in brazil with beyonce so oh. i i wasn't able to be reached um, the spongebob one. so like, like i just i just wish that like yeah, like if you were around like i know it obviously would have been different that's not my spongebob but not my spongebob you know, hadn't have happened because mm -hmm. obviously i'd like still be at wu chang i just wish you know I wish it hadn't have happened. That's Bong like Kebab. I already quit before I quit Wu Chang for like kind of similar reasons. Be like, I, like I, like, I spoke to Nico, I spoke to Noel, I spoke to everyone, and, you know, like everybody. I came back, you know, and now I just feel goofy if I if I come back again, you know, as like as much as I really want to, and like I'm like I'll just. I clench Q. Beautiful I mean, name. It's, it's it's not no Bong one's gonna think that. The only person that's thinking that is you. You know, all of the girls where does this come from? Wu Chang would love to have you here. Even our janitor Zoe, I'm sure she would love hey. to have you sign back. Woo! Right? Make some noise um, if you want me up here to be woo! signed to Wu Chang again. Woo! Woo! Oh, yeah. Yeah. See, uh, nobody uh, thinks that you're goofy. Nobody yeah. thinks that you're goofy. Okay, that's something <laughs> that you are you're putting on yourself because you know what? I think, I think you're, you're scared. Oh, mm. You're scared of letting yourself be the beautiful pop star that you were always meant to be under this label with the support that you deserve. I thought she was going to say, be who you are for your pride. I thought she was going to say, be who you is hang out. What? what? Oh I'm going to hang you bitches from your tampon string if you don't shut the fuck up. Oh my. <laughs> Sorry. Anyways. Like I was saying, Mia. Oh, yum. That's this awesome. is never going to happen again. And if mm -hmm. it does, 
if if anyone literally anyone in this building says anything to you and that that's not just for you but anyone here anyone comes at you any type of way tell me bitch i'm officially hr at this point i'm handling everything that's going on right um, so fuck that fuck people coming at you with an attitude right you know yeah. you're here to make music Ow. and <laughs> what is going oh. on no, I, I, was, I was giving Damn, an intense shoulder violent. rub i'm sorry Mia uh, sign to boot chain. Mia sign to boot oh, chain. Oh, a little harder next time. Guys, I can't even snap yeah. without it hurting. I just realized that. I tried snapping right. Well, <gasps> um, that's how sore so I am. Uh, where do we go from here? Obviously, um, I I think the plan of action is to sign you to the label, get you reintroduced, yeah. reacquainted mm -hmm. with um everyone. Sore and from what? what? I want to do is I'm going to talk to all the other executives about including everyone, people that we mm -hmm. don't see as often, you know? Yeah. Um, Because it is it? kind Hello? of the same. Right now, it feels very much like it's the same rotation of people. Like, right. That, that's how it's kind of always been with Wu-Tang, to be very honest. Yeah. And back in the day, I was just the girl that they would call to play because no one else had a train ticket. Mm -hmm. So... It was, I've, I've been there before. I've wanted to quit Wu-Tang before because of <laughs> the way that the management was handling things and right. how cookie it was. So I get it. And the I hatchet. don't want that to happen. Right. I want this to be a place where everyone can just make music and- Why did they delete it? Hello? Mm. Hi. Mm, right. Amen. I'll move you on that one, eh, fucking man. Oh yeah, there's a, been a lot of that already. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> I would hope so. We're still having an ongoing investigation about who left the anal lube in the bathroom. Oh. Mm -hmm. Is it still there, Shannon? Shannon? I'm looking it at is, you, Naomi. It is still there. I'll be right back, girl. I forgot something in the bathroom. But I'll be right back. Oh, wow. No, oh. I really do appreciate it, actually, Liz. I can really do. Because oh, that's not. Like, I really want to work at Wu Chang, but it's just like those things that happen it's just like it's the small things and they just like ruin it for every like they ruin it all they all they ruin all the good time i'm so confused though because didn't mm -hmm. damien cover one of your songs for the master yeah he did he did he covered sick thrill actually yeah but i, I didn't and i was like i was like i was really grateful he did that i thought it was like a really it was really good well um, interpretation of the song <laughs> You want to know something really funny, and this is just oh, this I'm is just being, you know, superstitious. You know, I used yeah. to be a witch for many years. I did brujeria. Mm -hmm. Oh my um, god, she's a she's a bruja. Real. Oh. She's a bruja. Because when I was getting mistreated on this label, you know who the two executives were? It was Oswald Tinkerman, Damien's mm -hmm. older brother, and mm -hmm. Young Fierro, and oh, wow. they would always tell me, "Oh, Liz." You can't be here. Oh, what is like, you know, making me feel like I'm I'm not like part of oh, wow. the company. Right. When I've been there longer than that. Oh and, wow. You know, did a couple more um certifications than them as well. But that's irrelevant from the Young whole thing. Fiero. You wanna know what happened, what happened? to to Oswald Tinkerman? Oh. Oh. Ooh, <laughs> what? Rest in peace. He died. He died. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Exactly. So, because they were talking about Hello. all this smack to me, when I found out what Oswald was doing, I told Mr. K, and um, you know, mm -hmm. shortly after Oswald died. Oh my God! And you oh know what God. happened to Young Fierro? He got the board. So, don't oh. fuck with Liz. What was Oswald Liz doing? Um, Oswald did a lot. Oswald did a lot, girls. I could talk about what Oswald did all day. Wait, it didn't um, work. Wait, what yeah, was Tatia? He, I know the the last straw with him. What was, was she? He actually kidnapped Nico Rain and <gasps> handcuffed him to the office oh. and uh, handcuffed him to the oh. chair oh, in the CEO office. Oh. And um, I actually walked Sounds in on kinky. him. Oh Nico Rain's so funny. Who is that? What the fuck? I don't think I've ever so, met this person. That's just unprofessional. That's like all yeah. of her brother. Yeah, and, and he, he held a gun towards him. <gasps> and, Ooh. Um, I think he was gonna murder Nico. Honestly, I was like, <gasps> I was like Oswald, you're doing this to the man who made your career. Oh. Like, right. This is really Ryan. to switch up the girls that are giving Liz with the Liz print. You know, like, what is going on here? So, 
Um, Damien's brother. Yeah, and then <laughs> no. I don't know. Also, this I think person, she was Joanne, kill Paris or something. Oh, she, I think she I met was her. In the garage, <laughs> and he had like a I don't crowbar. Think so. I don't know. And oh my I forgot. Gosh. Yeah. Oh wow. And then um, Lana and her boyfriend at the time came in here and like shot him up. I don't know. It was it was crazy. So yeah, good thing at he's first dead. <laughs> right. Good thing he's dead. Yeah. That guy sounds creepy. Girl. Yeah. He, he sounds he, kind he of was. psychotic. Hopefully and he. Doesn't... he Oh, they're he sick. Had a lot of, um, what? Power trips. You know, one time, Noelle was talking about. Um, I forgot what she was saying. This Something is about, sick. She just, we were just talking sick. about music, and then he walks in the studio, and he's like, "Hey guys, did you know that I'm number one all the way through number five on the charts?" And we we're like, "Okay." <laughs> <laughs> no way, he fucking no, because that bitch. Uh, what? what? We actually we broke his record. Like, it was Zoe. It was Zoe. Girl. Wait, no. Oh, he, he, he didn't. So he had number Let's one, number that. two, number three, like all the way from one to five on the charts were all of his songs at the same time. So that was, you know, that's that was Oswald. Mm. Oswald was fucking crazy. Damien is, you know, related to him, obviously. But Damien is so much more fucking cool than Oswald was. Like, I'm telling you guys, if. Damien still acts up sometimes, but fucking Oswald, mm. girl, oh. I'm so glad that he is six feet under the ground. Right. Oh, wow. Preach. Amen. Amen. A fucking man. Oh. Oh. Damn. What? Are you okay? Oh, yeah. So, so, Mia, are you, are you, um. Are you on board? Are you, um, yeah. What's going on? What's the final verdict, girls? I feel like, like we need to th back. we need to take a minute to think. I don't think we need to think about anything. I don't think we need to think anything at all. Yeah, I mean, really, what is there to think about? I told right. you I would check them true, any single true. chance that I got. It's yeah. not like it's not like I'm gonna let them keep talking shit to you and be like, oh yes, please fucking make me a beer and feel like she doesn't belong here. Please do that. You're right, you're right. Yes, I would be happy to come back to Wu Chang. I'd be happy. Amazing. And you're gonna stay this time. Yes, right? I'll be. This is the final time. I'll you, stay at Wu Chang until they die. You will communicate <laughs> with me anytime oh. there's a problem. Yes, I will. Yeah. Okay, An or the day. Uh, it's 22746. 22746. Okay. Two, three, four, five, Is six. That Thank you so much. Get in on Orthodox. Congrats, yes. Mia! Yes. Congratulations, oh I'm so proud of you. That's my kitten. Are you ready to you blossom? Are serving girl, yes. I'm ready to blossom. Oh my god, thank fucking god. god. I mean, <gasps> blossom yes. out of that cookie. Because, you know, why don't we go to the. Congrats! Woo. Let's go down. To why, the don't all, why don't we yes, all wait mommy. outside for her to blossom? Yes. Ow! That's what you deserve, Naomi. Don't fuck with me. Girl, is that a wig? Girl. That's a wig. That's Look a at your fucking nose. Here. Right, bro. Bitch, right. Look at your fucking nose. Girl, fucking you wish Michael you had Jackson my fucking nose, up. bitch. Naomi, Naomi's um, hair is made out of my armpit hair. Oh, that's... Girl. What? You have that? Yeah, I don't have that. your armpit hair is long enough to yeah, fucking be it. my hair. When I shave it. Dirty ass bitch. Okay, what? Yeah, I remember that. Remember a bit. Yeah, broad move? shoulders. Yeah, broad shoulders. Oh, Can someone I open do. this door? Nope, we're trapped. Um, screw over. I you love have the keys or something. Yes. Oh, I forgot you. 